All right, we're going to switch gears now and check in with Jeff to talk about our weather. And we've had a couple nice days, a couple right. overcast days. So Yesterday was kind of a... Ugh. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> if, if we don't put a word there, we just kind of put a noise, that's yeah. how yeah. I would describe yeah. the weather yesterday. Yeah. But Accurate. today is going to be much better. Uh, this is a live look now from the Rivermar Community Credit Union camera on top of the Portland Opera Building. If you look out in the distance, you can see some low clouds draped over the West Hills. So uh, there is reduced visibility in parts of our Western Valleys, especially as you go over the West Hills of Portland. And even in the South Salem Hills, we're dealing with some low clouds. Temperatures are chilly out there, especially on the West Side and up into the foothills of the Cascades, starting off in the mid to upper 30s. But uh, closer to the inner urban areas or the I-5 corridor, we're seeing temperatures in the low to mid 40s. Out along the coast, there are also some spots of fog, but nothing real significant. This is a live look uh, from the Discover Newport camera, 37 degrees out there. So similar to our Western Valleys, temperatures are starting off between the 30s and 40s. Really not a bad morning out there. Uh, you're going to end up seeing a lot of sunshine along the coast, and that's going to allow those temperatures to rise into the mid to upper 50s. So it'll be a pretty nice day, uh, but prepare for a little bit of a breeze if you're going to be maybe doing a beach walk with a north wind at about 10 to 15 miles per hour. Our Western Valleys are dealing with some low clouds and spots of fog. That should quickly clear out to a lot of sunshine if you're going to see any fog. Temperatures will max out between the upper 50s and the low 60s. Expect a mostly sunny day in the gorge. You'll feel that east wind if you're out toward Multnomah Falls, Cascade Locks, sustained at about 10 to 20 miles per hour, gusting to 30 miles per hour. Great day on tap for the Mount Hood area. If you're going to be doing some skiing and snowboarding, expect highs in the 30s and low 40s at our ski resorts. In central and eastern Oregon, we are tracking a few showers up to the northeast, but expect a lot of sunshine this afternoon. Much drier weather with highs in the 40s and 50s. Next couple of days are going to be great. Highs will top out around 60 with mostly sunny skies. Could see an isolated shower late in the day Wednesday. Expect that wet, cool weather to return Thursday, and we're going to be locked in with highs in the mid to upper 40s through at least Saturday with overnight lows trending into the 30s. So at times there could be a wintry mix or some wet snow in our local hills, especially in the morning hours. But I think we'll dry out and we'll start to warm back up Monday into Tuesday with highs in the 50s. Tony.